yawning? Really? You're just a computer program. You don't get tired. Hey, B.O. My temper's got a hair trigger, and you're awfully close to me. So I'd watch my mouth if I were you. Otherwise... Well, you're gonna need me to spell it out. I forget it. <laughs> That's a good boy. Alrighty! Let's get back to what we were talking about earlier. Namely, how do you get more BP? <laughs> But who goes into what room? <laughs> that doesn't really matter. Anybody can go into any room. But there are only six rooms. Didn't I tell you? The two members of a pair share the same destiny! Then you mean both members of a pair need to go into the same room? Yes! 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 What do we do after we go into the room? Play a game! Just like it says on the door! You play the Ambidex game! Wait, what's Ambidex supposed to mean anyway? I would guess it's short for ambidextrous. Most use the word to refer to the ability to use both of one's hands, instead of favoring the left or right. But it can also be taken to mean someone who is duplicitous or two-faced. Well, yes, I guess you could be that way. Then what's the nonary game? Why are you just hurry? Look. There's something on the screen. Astute observation. Hooray! Everybody's finally here! I've been waiting. Will oh! oh, all of you please stop bombarding me with questions? The other people in the other rooms are asking me stuff just like you are, Siggy! I guess you probably can't hear them since these rooms are completely soundproof, but... B.O. is especially loud! For real, B.O., I need you to shut up! There isn't much time. I better hurry and explain all this stuff, or the game will end before I'm done! Now, let's get this party started! Let me take 
Alien about the AD game. Since it's a game, you're obviously going to have an opinion. But it's not like this is a battle royale where you just fight everybody. Each round will be a one-on-one -on -one battle. Mono a mono or mono a womano. Well, there are two people in each pair, aren't there? So it'll be more of a two-on-one battle, I guess. <laughs> Your opponent is going to be. It's actually really easy. You'll be competing against whoever you paired up with to go through the chromatic doors. For example, Siggy and Fido paired up with Mooney and went through the magenta door, didn't they? That means that Siggy and Fido will be playing against Mooney. And it goes the other way, too. Mooney's opponent will be Siggy and Fido. Obviously, that means potassium and Cleaver's enemy will be alas. And B.O. and Quirk's enemy will be Ten Me Oldie. Well, I guess enemy isn't really the right word, is it? After all, if you choose ally, then they're your ally. What? Don't get it? Well, don't worry. Just listen while Zero the Third explains it all. First, I want everybody to focus on the screen on the device in the back of the room. You should see A, ally, and B, betray on it. Do you? All you guys have to do is pick! Just pick one of those easy options! Your DP will go up or down. It's a little complicated, and some of you are a little smooth. So, I made this honey chart. The plus and minus are from your point of view. So, let's say you choose ally, and so does your opponent. You get two BP, and so will they. And you'll all get a nice warm, fuzzy feeling inside. We call that the best pals outcome. Just puts a smile on your face, doesn't it? Next is what you get if you choose ally. But your opponent chooses to betray. If that happens, you lose 2 BP. And they get 3. We call that the stupid jerk face outcome. Somebody did that to me, let's see them stew them with some tires. The third choice is the opposite of that. It's when you choose betray, but your nice, innocent opponent chooses ally. This time, you're the one who gets 3 DD, and they're the one who loses too. We call that the serves them right outcome. I mean, what were they thinking? Choosing ally was a stupid choice. And there's nothing for you to feel guilty about! And finally, the very last scenario. This is when you choose betray, and so does your opponent. If that happens, neither you get to lose something. Absolutely zero chance. Uh, boring! We call this the why even bother outcome. As the game master here, this is the situation I want to avoid the most. You're probably wondering about the pairs, aren't you? Well, let me explain. <laughs> Remember how I told you that both people in a pair share a destiny? Well, that applies here too. The two of you only get one vote. You get to choose once between ally or betray. That doesn't mean you split your points, though. You both get three points, or lose two points, or whatever. In other words, what you see on this chart is what you get. Okay, then. I think that about does it for the basic rules. <laughs> Actually, there's a little bit more, but... Yeah, this happened.
can't wait, I guess. After all, it's almost time! No, I won't wait and I can't wait. Didn't you hear me? It is time! You see, it's time for me to be hopping on out of here. See you later! Have a nice trouble.